I'm Adil Kumar. Welcome to my series on Matrix. We have an excellent example here where we are going to solve matrices. The question here is find the 2 by 2 matrix A and B such that 3A plus 4B is equal to 1001 0, 0, 1, and 2A plus 3B is 5 minus 1, 2, 2. Now we can always perform addition on these matrices since uh, they are same 2 by 2 matrices. Now to solve such equations, we'll take help of the properties learn and scalar multiples. Our approach is going to be very similar to what we have in solving linear equations, right? So those concepts will help you to solve this question. 3a plus 4b is given to us, 2a plus 3b is given to us. What should we do? Well, the first step should be that we should uh, ensure that any one of their corresponding coefficients become similar so that we could add and subtract and eliminate. So idea is to solve by elimination, right? Now for doing that, what am I going to do? I'm going to multiply the, the first set of the information right here by 2, right? And the other set by 3. So when I do that, I get 6a, correct? And then we will take away and find the solution. So what we get here is times 2, we get 6a plus 8b equals 2. Scalar multiple, each and every element inside is now going to get multiplied by 2. So we get 2, 0, 0, 2, correct? And for the other matrix, what we get here is times 3. We get 6a plus 9b equals 2. Times 3 means 15 minus 3, 6 and 6. So we get our other two equations. Let's call these equations as equations 2 and 3, right? So those are 1 and 2 equations. These we'll call as 3 and 4. Okay. Now what we can do here is we will do 4 minus 3. Equation number 4 minus equation number 3. So 6a, 6a will cancel out. 9b minus 8b will result into b equals to what? 15 minus 2, which is 13, minus 3 minus 0 is minus 3. 6 minus 0 is 6. 6 minus 2 is 4. So we get one of our matrix B, which is 2 by 2 matrix as expected, and that's what it is. Now, we need to find what matrix A is. So we could use one of our equations and then solve for it. So let's use a second equation. We'll calling this as equation 1, this is equation 2. So using our second equation, we can find the value of A. So we have 2A equals 2. 5 minus 1, 2, 2, minus 3b. So now we can write this as 5 minus 1, 2, 2, minus 3 times. The matrix B is 13 minus 3, 6 and 4. So now first let's do scalar multiplication, which gives us 3 times 3 is 9, 39, minus 9, 18, and 12. And that gives us, so when you take away from, uh, you get minus 5 from this, negative, you get negative 34. And here you have to do the corresponding elements. That becomes positive 9, right? So, and when you do, we get positive 8. And here we get eight mi 2 minus 18, which is minus 16. We get 2 minus 12, which is 10, with a negative sign. Now that is twice A, right? So what is A equals to? So A will be equals to half of this. Minus 34, minus 16, 8, minus 10. Which is equal to minus 17, 4 minus 8 minus 5. Correct? So, so that is what you get your answer now.
perfect. So that is how you should be solving. So our answer here is matrix A is equal to minus 17, 4, minus 8, minus 5. And matrix B is equal to 13, minus 3, 6, and 4. Correct. So I hope the steps are absolutely clear. That is how you should be solving such questions. Feel free to write your comment, share your views, and if you like and subscribe to my videos, that'll be great. Thanks for watching and all the best.